All right, I just want to thank you guys for coming. I know you guys could have been anywhere today, so it's really special to us that you guys would choose to share your time with us, and that means a lot to us, so let's get started. Okay, so it's called the Breaking Borders Workshop. So our main goals are to inspire people, to get to know people that don't, they wouldn't normally interact with, to empower people to learn about different cultures and build cultural competency, and to educate. So to get started, we're going to challenge you to stretch a little bit outside your comfort zone, to be open, to be receptive to new ideas, to new ways of thinking, and lastly, just to respect people's lived experiences. Um, because what we're asking people to do is, it's pretty delicate, it's pretty, it's pretty like, it's a very, it takes a lot of strength to share your lived experiences with people you don't know and people you're trying to get to know. So I just ask everybody to please be respectful of that, and we'll jump into it. Just like the organization of the event, there was like squabbles and stuff. So I think just like getting a, at least a little bit more understanding of different people's cultures or just their opinions at all, just listening to each other is um, is important. And just like having a forum to be heard by your peers and like just like everyone. I mean, we, hopefully next semester is a little bit bigger crowd, but um, I think it's just important to like talk about issues like this, uh, everything we talked about and and more like um, just yeah breaking down walls basically between race and gender and everything. Especially in today's social climate, there's not a lot of dialogue going on with one another, more more than there is debate. And to, the point of today was not to debate with anyone, but to simply express one's experience to make other people aware of what people have to say. An actual formal setting to talk about um, uh, like racial divides and um, the differences between our cultures and how we see each other. Um, I think a lot of people, you know, just kind of take each other at face value and judge based on stereotypes right away. And um, just being able to hear people's opinions about their own stereotypes and um, just seeing how, basically how people see themselves and how that differs from how we see them. Um, and hopefully be able to just connect more um, despite our differences. Um, I hope that anyone that was there today feels free to like talk to me outside of it. If, if anyone wants to speak more, like they're welcome um, to come to Black Collegians and we'll have these kind of discussions um, opening the gates to open communication because the easiest way to create conflict is not communicating and not understanding each other. And so the more we have open dialogue about things, the more we can understand each other and the better you know, relations will be between students and just people in general. We really hope that they take away new characteristics of understanding, compassion for others, kind of see everyone and everything under a new light, one that could bring us together more than it pushes us apart. 